In this video, we will determine the number of elements in a set using a Venn diagram. Remember, the number of elements in a set is called the cardinality of the set. In a survey of 109 pet owners, 74 said they own a dog and 26 said they own a cat. 15 said they own both a dog and a cat. How many owned neither a cat nor a dog? Let's begin by recording the given information. Because the survey consists of 109 pet owners, we can say the number of elements in the sample set or the cardinality of set S is equal to 109, indicated using this notation here, n of S equals 109. And now looking at the Venn diagram, we will let D equal the set of dog owners and C equal the set of cat owners. Because 74 said they own a dog, we know the number of elements in set D or the cardinality of set D is equal to 74. 26 said they own a cat, and therefore the number of elements in set C is equal to 26, or the cardinality of set C is equal to 26. And finally, 15 said they own both a dog and a cat, which means the number of elements in set D and set C is equal to 15. And now let's begin to label the Venn diagram. Because we know the number of elements in set D and set C is equal to 15, the intersection of set C and D must contain 15 elements. Let's go ahead and label this, which would be this set here. And now before we can answer the question, we need to determine the number of elements that are only in set D, as well as the number of elements only in set C. Beginning with the number of elements only in set D, we know the number of elements in set D is equal to 74, but this is the set D, and the set only D would be this set here. So because we know there are 74 elements in set D, 15 of which are also in C, the number of elements only in set D is equal to 74, the number of elements in set D, minus the number of elements in set D and set C, which is 15, 74 minus 15 is equal to 59. So there are 59 elements only in set D, which again is this set here in purple. And now let's determine the number of elements that are only in set C. We are given there are 26 elements in set C. So here's set C. There are 26 elements in this set. The set only C is this set here. And therefore, the number of elements that are only in set C is equal to the number of elements in set C, which is 26, minus the number of elements in set C and set D, which is 15. 26 minus 15 is equal to 11. There are 11 elements that are only in set C. And now we have the information we need in order to answer the question. And again, the question is, how many owned neither a dog nor a cat? which we can also indicate as a number of elements not in C and not in D, or the number of elements in C complement and D complement, which means we're trying to find the number of elements in the sample set here that are not in set D and not in set C, which is equal to the total number surveyed of 109, and then minus the sum of 59, 15, and 11. So minus the quantity 59 plus 15 plus 11, which is equal to 24. So now we know of the 109 pet owners surveyed, 24 of them owned neither a cat nor a dog. I hope you found this helpful.